That's why we need some men of the air. I'm going to tell you that axe uh, that we need the man of the air and the uh, king brand. We, yeah, oh god, we have lots of mo uh, resources, 4k. Uh, I'll get definitely king brand. This will favor the dwarves. Yeah. I'll rush. Men of Dale and King Brand. King Brand. We need Men of Dale against Isengard and Elves. <coughs> Good luck. I have the strength to bring mud my peak to fight to them. So many battle white in the middle of the map. Really creeps them all. Signori, welcome to the party indeed, my friend. Oof. Forgot the ring turned on. Early stream indeed. Oh, uh, shit. There's a charcoal. Just die, war riders. We can't fight this Sharku. If you put anything outside of the tunnel, he's going to deal area damage. Actually, they're bringing. What? Seriously? They're bringing the ring. Are they both attacking me? But we're still fine. They uh, got to be... No, I don't think they're trolling. Uh, they just gave me the ring, so I... Uh, so I... Um, maybe take longer time. 
uh, and recruit Galadriel, but I'm not gonna recruit her. I know that uh, Biscuit KD is uh, a fine player, but the other player, Pikachu, I don't know anything about him. Anyway, I'm not gonna show any mercy. And we are going to... Uh, just try hard. Let's buy one of the demolisher. Because Men of Dale will win this fight here. And hey, Mr. CV, good morning. Warg Riders. Warg Riders die very quickly against the arrows. Yeah, you see. Damn it, I want to save this outpost. Hopefully, never mind, it will fall. And Isengard is always weak against fire arrows. I mean, arrows overall. Which makes King Brand the best versus Isengard. Hey, Sri was here. Good morning. Okay, these war riders are really annoying. Uh, keep dealing, but without Sharku, they are so weak. No leadership. Okay, it's fine now. He's planning to take the fight to me instead of before I send this army to him they have fire arrows and will buy the uh, mithril armor this one on the men of Dale. this is the strongest mithril armor is the strongest versus the isengard we can put also the mithril armor on this demolisher please save this uh, I miss uh, okay sure I'll save the stream so I can watch it. You've been probably watching Sriwa's here uh, games. Uh, I mean, sponsored games. Uh, recently, more than Rise of Witch King. On my Twitch, Twitch channel. Oh, wow. He was going for upgrades. You know what? We'll try to take out this demo uh, armory. And our op wait, my ally is not doing good, I think. Yeah, against the Noldor is not doing good. I need to just finish my opponent before I need to finish my opponent before uh, my ally dies to the Elven player, I guess. And this one needs to be repaired. Yeah, I really need to finish this opponent here. Because dwarves struggle against the elves. And maybe he is Noldor. I mean, you see this Antmoot? Can destroy my ally. Mithril armor. Oh god, I love the demolisher. And Legolas is visiting us. Black arrow hurts Legolas, I think. Yeah, almost killed him. But he healed him. Uh, let's get the dwarven riches. It is the best. Demolisher is not dying. Oh god, what's that? Very, very smart from him. Uh, attacking me with the ram. I don't even know where this ram came from. But we can... Is he really trying to take the fortress down? Nah, it's safe. The fortress is safe. And we, I can't do anything here. The elven player is helping his ally. Yeah, we have the mithril armor. We'll put it on the demolisher. Okay, fine. We have the dwarven riches. Mithril armor on every dwarven warrior. And our fortress is 
safe because we got the armor on it. Okay. Does anyone uh, struggle against the elves? Yes. A goblins and the dwarves struggle against the elves, ignoring. They always struggle against the elves. Yes. But, uh, but the dwarves will not struggle anymore, uh, dwarves, in the upcoming version. Because dwarves will get much, much stronger. Good morning, Mr. Smoke, the guy who knows about life. Who's good against the goblins? Uh, who's good against the elves? Uh, Mordor catapults are so good against the elves. And also, um, Mr. Smoke, what's good? Yeah, Angmar. Angmar is also good against the elves. Because they have very, very strong... Um, Noldor OP. Noldor archers are so deadly. Let's just, I don't like glowing, honestly. Let's just push one more time. We have a demolisher. Let's go. And uh, everything is this. That siege uh, is good against um, uh, elves. Like anything that is catapult or stuff like that. Siege, catapult, things. Like demolisher is good against the elves because when they shoot it, uh, it is made of wood and the arrows are not gonna penetrate. So the damage is gonna be very low and catapults are also made of wood. So it is the same. Okay, and my Isengard opponent is ready. He's, he keeps sending his war riders. And Demolisher also tramples like if it is a cav or horses or battle wagons. You see, it kills what it it uh, smashes. Only the pikemen. I love Demolisher. Actually, dwarves, they have two kind of cav. Uh, a battle wagon and uh, Demolisher. Uh, and we, you can repair it also. We'll send it back home. I like when the Orokai scream and say Saruman. And, and we can repair this one at home at level 2 forge work mm, My ally is struggling against the elves and Noldor That's a big army we got just maybe we'll buy I am broke. I'll send my ally some resources Oh god Come on, beast. <laughs> They're playing good, uh, the other team. Got Men of Dale. Is this Demolisher? Uh, I mean, Ram from the enemy should not. Fire arrows should hurt them, I hope. Okay, low damage fire arrows. That's lots of... He's trying to take our fortress, but we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Okay. That did not go well. Uh, let's forget his fortress. Actually, we defended here. Now, let's see how he's gonna defend. Okay, and this one is repaired. Back here. Okay, this is a little bit hard now. Because the elven player keeps helping his ally. Um, let's get Gimme, we have uh, resources. Yeah, we have... God damn it. Helping your ally is the best secret. In two versus two games. If you help your ally, you're gonna double one player, and two players can easily kill one player, no matter how good he is. But we got Gimme. So we're fine, I think, I hope. 
And I like dwarves because they have two summons, men of Dale and hobbits, and they are two armies, additional army. My ally needs like a, oh yeah, he, he has catapults and archers and Gimni. He doesn't have resources for Gimni. Okay. Mistral armor always. Yeah, it's just the elves are so deadly. When trouble rises, send a dwarf. I don't like dwarven heroes normally, but we're forced. I think they are too expensive. That's why I don't buy them. I tr I'll try to finish the dwarves, uh, the elves, before... I'll try to finish the uh, Isengard before my ally. Actually, it starts getting catapults. Before m the elf finishes my ally. So many siege are needed. Catapults, battle wagon, and demolisher. Dwarves need to siege work, I think. Come on, come on. And these units should defend us, I think. Demolisher, uh, I mean ram, battering ram. And they did not see this tunnel. Oh god damn it, he's defending himself. This dwarf uh, Isengard player. How am I supposed to take his fortress? How am I supposed to take his fortress? Actually, my ally is doing good. With the catapult spread, lightning might happen from his fortress. We'll try to destroy his economy. Yeah, we need catapults here, I guess. Yeah, my ally is doing so good with these uh, catapults against the elves. Fire catapults are so good against the elves. Lovely. Okay. <laughs> Let's buy glowing. We have some resources. Can we summon hobbits here so we destroy structures? Yeah, this is funny. They're defending this way. With the wall. <laughs> the demolisher behind did lots of uh, good work. Okay. Uh, I don't want King Dane. You stay defended here. Why don't we want King Dane just for more units and command points? Gimni is behind. Okay. 
Black Arrow will kill Lurz. Lurz is not a beast, he doesn't count as a beast, but... <coughs> I'll send some resources for my ally. Uh, to recover, and what's going on here? Damn it. My opponent really wants to take my fortress with all costs with this ram, but Dwarven Fortress is the tankiest fortress, it cannot be taken, and also this uh, battering ram are not as strong as uh, Demolisher, so the fortress is gonna be safe, especially that we got repair. Okay. <clears throat> Defended our fortress. Flaming boulders. I heard the ants summon. Yeah, he, so here they are. Legolas level 10 Did Legolas die? I think this is the best summon for the dwarves, a uh, summon citadel in the enemy's base. Good game. First quake doesn't destroy the fortress. And my ally is beating his opponent. Oh god, I love the dwarven catapults. I saw the battle for Middle Earth to um, zoom. It's very, very zoomed out. I think the best zoom is this zoom, uh, very close. The game is not about um, macro, it's about quality quality of units I always like to ha give allies the resources this is a bad habit yeah Liker played really good defended against the elves men of dale normally are good against the elves <clears throat> there is something in common between elves and uh, f uh, mordor and it is, oh god, ram, 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 ram. This ram want to destroy our fortress, but never succeeded. 
there is something in common between the elves and uh, Mordor. It is the weakness against fire. Elves and Mordor are both weak against fire. I think that guy was Demi Hot. Or maybe Red Army. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this guy is Demi. There is something with the graphic between Battleform uh, Age of the Ring and Rise of the Kings.